filtering old, under-sink recovery system. When washing hands, or objects in a sink, significant amounts of precious metals are typically washed down the drain. By placing the filter gold under your sink, these losses stop. It automatically recovers everything. Even particles as small as 10 microns and smaller. The filter gold incorporates four separate recovery systems. The first line of defense is the sink screen. This will catch settings, rings, or other substantial items that are inadvertently dropped into the sink. Next, a cloth pouch. The pouch will catch grindings or other large precious metal particles of similar size. The third line of defense is a 5-gallon settling tank. Most of the smaller particles settle to the bottom of the tank. Even while your sink's faucet is running, the water in the tank is relatively calm, allowing most of the smaller particles to settle to the bottom of the tank. The reason for this is twofold. First, the pouch diffuses the water flow. And second, the submersible pump is located at the very top of the tank, leaving most of the water calm and unruffled. The last recovery system is the 10 micron filter. When the tank becomes almost full, the pump's integrated float switch activates, signaling the pump to push water from the top of the tank through the 10 micron cotton wound filter. Any gold that makes it past the first three recovery systems will be caught in this filter. Lift off the cover and remove the contents of the tank. Remove the filter chamber, the filter pouch and support, the hose, and the sink screen filter. Assembly is simple and easy. Replace the cover. Insert the cloth pouch and cap. Slide in the filter chamber and attach the hoses. Assembly complete. Installation is a snap. First, remove the U-trap under your sink. Place the filter gold under the sink, positioning the cloth pouch directly under the drain. Insert the expansion fitting into your wall pipe and turn the wing nut to expand the rubber against the inside wall of the pipe, creating a snug fit. Then, just place the screen filter into your sink and you're all set. The filter gold requires very little maintenance. Over a period of several weeks or months, the cotton wound filter will become clogged with gold bearing debris. As you can see in this video, filters are easy to replace. They are also inexpensive. Scheduled replacement, once every 60 days, is typical. But, over time, you will determine the best schedule, based upon your usage. Most of your gold-bearing debris will have settled to the bottom of the tank. This can be retrieved at any time, but typically, it's recovered once every 6 to 12 months. It may just look like dirt, but this material contains thousands of dollars worth of gold. Contrary to popular belief, retrieval of gold from sweeps and settling tanks is not difficult. Because refining companies commonly keep 90% of the gold from this kind of material, we recommend that you either refine it yourself or reduce it to shot or ingot form. The first retrieval step is burning. You can do this outdoors in a steel pan. Or, if you have a burnout oven, you can use that. The key to successful burning is air. You want to turn the organic material, the rouge, rubber, and buff fibers 
into carbon dioxide, not coal. Once everything is burned, the only thing left is metal, silicates, and grey ash. You can refine this material, or you can simply melt it, after dissolving the silicates in lye and water. Detailed instructions for these time-tested techniques can be found embedded on the Shaw website. If you have any questions regarding this product, or any other products or processes, please feel free to contact Shaw. We will be happy to help you. Remember, there is no such thing as a stupid question, except the one you don't ask.